Lagos residents are still groaning over the high prices of foodstuffs in the open market as the effects of inflation bites harder. Justine Akadonia speaks to both buyers and sellers at the Mile 12 market to review current market prices. His report. Over the past few months, Nigerians have been lamenting over the general price increase in foodstuffs in Nigeria. Over time, they have indeed paid double for what they would have paid to buy foodstuffs in their households. The National Bureau of Statistics says the consumer price index increased by 17.75% in June 2021. This simply implies that prices continue to rise in June 2021, but at a slightly slower rise than it did in May. The prices today leave much to be desired. Muduna is 750, 760 as of this week, but the other weeks 770, 780. Uh, the same thing that three months ago it was sold 650, 670, 700. From our survey, the price of staples, including gari, rice, and beans, have almost doubled. In three months, as buyers lament, the traders attribute the increment to diverse reasons. Back of Olu to this one, we are selling 57000 57000 Yeah. And how much do you sell alone? Alone, we are selling 40. Two months ago, we are selling this one, it's like 47000 I just buy like paint to it. I think before it was um, one five eight hundred dirty can no. The same can be said for vegetables. For tomatoes, although the price has reduced in recent weeks, this buyer says she bought for half the price months ago. For tubers and other root crops, the prices have reduced considerably, while some traders say it is as a result of farming activities. The chairman of the Mount of Market, Shehu Jibril, believes it is all a factor of demand and supply. For your quality, this one, 3035 but now we are selling 2,500 It keeps fluctuating because sometimes you can get it lower. Once it is ripe in the farm, you have no option than to bring it to the market and sell. Of course, when you bring it to the market, it also depends on the demand of the people at stake in the market. Like if you come to the market, you have a lot of trucks that come with the same product you bring. You may not sell it more expensive than you're expecting. Gibral is hopeful that prices will drop in the coming months. From November, December, January, February, March, April, May, June, May, up to May, that's when you have the northern crops from every part of the north. This one will ripe and will bring it to Lagos and other parts of the country to sell. The decline in the rate of increase in the consumer price index indicates that the inflation rate in Nigeria might have peaked and is on its way downward. However, it is still worth noting that an inflation rate of 17.75% is still way higher than the 11.02% recorded before the closure of the land borders in 2019. Justin Akadonye, Plus TV African News. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.